was a shocking sight for many drivers in Antelope. What appeared to be dead horses hung from their hind legs in the backyard of a home. Drivers were passing by so concerned they called animal control to make a complaint of animal cruelty. CBS 13's Anjali Hemphill is in Antelope with what it really was. And we do have to warn you, what you're about to see could be disturbing. Horses grazing peacefully in pastures, a familiar sight on any day as you drive along Alberta Road near Antelope. But some drivers recently got a shock they weren't expecting. Looks like a dead animal hanging. That's disgusting. A jaw-dropping image easily seen from the roadway. What appears to be two dead horses hanging from their hind legs in the backyard of Eric Haygood's Wednesday home. Morning, we started seeing that there were all these cars piling up and stopping traffic and people getting out. Yeah. This, some people came over and they said, so, you know, are those horses real? And we're like, well, no, no, these are props, you know, <laughs> of course they're not real. Some drivers got so upset they called animal control. It would bother me. Yeah, yeah it would bother me, yeah. especially if we yeah. drove by and we thought, it this guy's real. skinning a horse, yeah, that would bother me. And I'd be the first guy to call in. <laughs> Turns out, Haygood is co-owner of Colson Manor, a haunted house held every year at the Placer County Fairgrounds. The idea is you, you go into this, this old western town and you, you don't come out. And these hanging horses are just props to be used in the new zombie western-themed portion of the attraction. And I know that there's a lot of controversy on things going on right now with um, uh, uh, animal cruelty things, and, and so that's, that's probably why it's been such a, a thing that kind of blew up so quickly. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, we're, you know, we're all animal lovers here. Haygood shows us they are nothing more than uh, styrofoam skulls. and paint. But from the roadway, it's hard to tell. I think you should take it down. It's a very busy road with a lot of kids, you know, a lot of traffic. It's all for the, all, all part of the show, all part of the storyline. Our apologies, we, we, weren't, we weren't trying to cause any trouble. Now, after the CBS 13 interview, the hanging horses were moved so they aren't so easily seen from the road. The haunted house opens in October.